Hey everybody and welcome. We're gonna take a look at Pensacola Beach. We're gonna drive all around and see a bunch of fun things and hopefully it gets you excited for your trip to Pensacola Beach. Let's take a look. Normally I start at the beach, but today I'm actually gonna do something different. I'm gonna show you a pool at the Holiday Inn. It is such a special little spot. This is right on the beach. There is a walkway over to the beach and they have a great pool with just a swim around, kind of lazy river type of pool. It's just a really sweet spot. And right next door is a new tower hotel with a lazy river in the back. It's going to be great. All right, we're going to head over to Casino Beach, you guys. And they are painting the beach ball water tower, which, you know, it maybe it needed a little brightening up, but it's going to be ready for you guys. When you come and visit, it's going to be amazing. But let's take a little look at the beach itself. It's just gorgeous. It's lovely. The sand is amazing. And I cannot wait to show you. And here's the snack shop, you guys. It's really cute. They have some fun things you can buy. They have snacks, of course. They have food and drinks and you know, umbrellas and boogie boards and sunglasses. It's great. And here's the dock, you guys. This is one of my favorite places to come when I come down to the beach and hang out. And it's right on the Gulf and of course, how can you miss that? Good friends, good people, and just beaching it. Nothing fancy, but it's a lot of fun. And here's crabs, you guys. I really absolutely love crabs. It's a great little spot to come and have dinner. They, a lot of times, will have music out on the patio. And right on the side of crabs, they do have a little beach store, so you can buy some souvenirs and some beachy things. And there is a trolley that will take you to various places along Pensacola Beach. That usually opens at the end of May and runs through Labor Day weekend, and so you can catch that at various stops along the way in Pensacola Beach. And sometimes it's nice to get away from the rush of the main beach area. And I would recommend coming down to the beach area by Fort Pickens, Park West. It's actually a nice little spot with picnic tables. And there is a bathroom. They're renovating it right now, but it's a really nice place. You can walk along the sand or there's boardwalks that will take you over the dunes to the beach. So it's really pretty. And in addition to that, across the street, there is a parking lot there as well. So if it's full on this side, park on that side and then just walk on over. And of course, you're gonna have a lot of other options to just park along the side and take advantage of the beach. There may not be amenities, but there's a lot of places to go and just enjoy the beach. There's the dog park beach. So if you're bringing your furry friends, then they can come to the beach as well. There's two designated dog park beaches. So if you just want something a little more simple, a little more quiet, maybe you wanna check one of these out along the beach. There is a new restaurant at the boardwalk, which is called Whiskey Joe's. And I had a really hard time finding a parking spot over there. So I would recommend if you guys wanna check that out or even flounders, I would park over here at the Casino Beach parking lot and just take the crosswalk over to the boardwalk. All right, next up, we're gonna check out Lagunas. And this is one of the family fun places. You can find a ton of different activities. They have ropes course, they have a climbing wall, they have a splash pad, they even have parasailing and jet skis. And of course, they have a restaurant and bar, which is just beautiful. There's a lot of fun seating and they do have an outdoor bar with a large screen. So if you're trying to catch a game, it's a lot of fun. They also do have fire pits and other types of beach seating here right alongside the waterfront. And this is one of the locations for Glow Paddle. So this is kind of a fun little activity if you wanna do something with your family at night. 
and right next door is Radical Rides, which they have jet skis and parasailing. It's a really cute spot and also just really fun to hang out. And lastly, we're going to take a look at Paradise Bar and Grill. And this is one of my local favorite places to come. It's just a really pretty place to catch a sunset. They have a band usually coming in on the weekends. And it's just such a relaxed and chill spot to hang out. So I recommend stopping by. And it may not seem like a whole lot from the outside, but it is a lot of fun. And if you're looking for a place that maybe locals might go, this is your spot. And that concludes my update from Pensacola Beach. I hope that gets you guys excited to come and visit. It is waiting for you and it is ready and beautiful. So thank you so much for watching and I will catch you soon.